and we are back. After a long hiatus, we're back, yeah! Finally Woo! back to the devils. May care attitudes will prevail. I was going to say can... may, may cry, but yes, yeah. may care also. <laughs> they may also, care. Also, uh, do you remember what we were doing here in the subway? Because I... So I really do. We partnered up with V. Ha, look um, how many souls you have, real quick. <laughs> I have a lot. <laughs> Sixty-six thousand six hundred sixty-six. Best way to start an episode. <laughs> so we're a little bit back from when we were last time because I had to get back up to this part. Yeah, I mean, we ended right after this big battle, I think. Yeah, we yeah. had a we had a lot of games come out when this game first premiered, and we kind of had to. It's very much well. Very much the feast part of the feast or famine. Yes. I mean, because we have what? Celeste, Sekiro, Celeste, Sekiro, Hat yeah. in Time, <sighs> Devil Sekiro May so Cry. Uh, we still had leftover Darkest Dungeon. God, we still haven't even gotten back to Hollow Knight. Yeah, Hollow I know. <laughs> Our Hollow Knight is like, have you forgotten us? It's like, no. Like, this sounds really hard. It, it's very hard. We're we want to play another hard game. Well, we don't want to bring the same content again and again and again yeah. and again and again we without have any progress. Not so. Forgot. Yeah, as soon as stuff starts slowing down, we will be back to dedicated practice on that. It's just, it's the hardest content out there, man. And I yeah. haven't been able to give you guys what I want to give you, so content be damned. Yeah. I will, I will, uh, you know, be give putting it, it off until I can get into it. Regardless, we're back at Devil May Cry. Yeah. It feels good to be back to this. It it's does been, feel what, good. It's been a two-week hiatus. So. I really wanted to keep playing this, but I wasn't able to because, like, got to save it for the channel. Got to save it for the channel. Yeah, yeah. So luckily, you bought Sekiro, so I was like, ooh, I'll just play that for a while. Thinking, it, it was an equal exchange, right? Yeah, Where it was just like, all right, well, if, I, if we're going to hold off Sam from playing his game, let him play Let him play the one that we're playing currently and get way ahead of me and be like, ha, you think that's hard? <laughs> Fucking pleb. <laughs> wait, wait till you get farther. Which is so funny because I didn't think I was going to like that game because I've never enjoyed Dark Souls games. Mm -hmm. Mostly for the aesthetic, similar to the vein of Devil May Cry where typically you're like, why would you like this aesthetic? This scene is completely It's pretty, it's pretty dark, way. morbid and stuff, but uh, Devil May Cry definitely has that style part to it. Whereas Dark Souls and, and, and stuff like that have kind of like that dark, everything sucks, everything's dark, everything's corrupt, and everything shit sucks, bad. nasty, nasty, nasty. That's what pulls me into this game, because even though Darkest Dungeon has that, it has more of a Mignola, um, Hellboy vibe to mm -hmm. it, and yeah. this game has that fun, just easygoing act, just like, yeah, shit's bad, but hey, let's some crack some jokes. Funny how that works, where it's you get the you get the visuals and they're all nasty and disgusting. Those are probably gonna explode on you. Oh no, they just send stuff your way. Uh, but you can have like this version. Get out of here, wrong, wrong game. And then you can have like the uh, darkest dungeon style, where it's a little bit more like comic booky, and you're like, okay, there's not so many horrifying things at once. And then you get like the Dark Souls style or the the Soulsborne games, where it's Really disgusting and pretty dismal, like the like yeah. the D rank right there. And it, while they're all in the same vein of kind of gothic, kind of nasty, kind of body horror, you know, type of uh, aspects to it, you get to see whole different takes on it. I think for that's, sure, that's pretty tight. And the biggest thing for me too is just gameplay. Like I can yeah. I can take a game if it doesn't look great, but if it mm -hmm. plays really well, I don't care. I'll play it yeah. um, if I'm having fun. And they definitely do play incredibly different. Even Sekiro and Devil May Cry. Yeah, Sekiro really feels like a a Sekiro. I keep saying it wrong. I, I don't know. <laughs> I think <laughs> it's fucking stuck on the escalator. I think it's Sekiro because it's two Japanese words combined to co make sets as lone wolf. Like I think oh, okay. Seki means lone and Ro means wolf. I was watching a Did You Know Gaming one where they I talked have, about it. I have that on my watch later list. And but I yeah, you're like, oh, I don't want to spoil anything. Well, I mean, yeah, but I, I kind of want to like have little talking points and stuff, That's like true. for the development and, and everything. Yeah. Um, but it's kind of hard not to get spoiled on stuff when people are going to be like, oh man, I really want to see Chris's reaction to the snake boss. <laughs> that's in it's the like, trailer. but that's in the trailer. Like, so Don't I, worry, there's other bullshit things in that yeah, game. I'm sure I'm going to be like, holy fuck! But at the same time, don't expect, you know, entirely unique uh, takes on that for that specific boss. 
you know, I've heard about other bosses, like an evil monkey boss and then a terrible fireball boss. That boss video is great. Um, but uh, beyond that, like, you still, guys haven't still seen donkeys. You make some good stuff. Yeah, go watch the dunkster. Um, is oh. it dude, I know we're not focusing too much on gameplay right now, but it's very hack and slash. Yeah, I you mean, know, we can have other conversations. Um, we're, we have a but, lot of episodes. But I did want to talk about real quick because uh, uh, I don't think I've mentioned her before. Girlfriend reviews. Have you seen her stuff? Uh, I haven't watched a lot of it. I know you've sent me a couple of things, but yeah. I just haven't gotten to it. She just did one where it was uh, girlfriend reviews of what's the farming game or whatever. Uh, Stardew Valley? I think it was Stardew Valley. I didn't play it, so I don't... It might be incorrect. It might be a different farming it's game. It's probably Stardew Valley, because the yeah. last one before that was Harvest Moon, and that was like 10 years before. It is definitely the newer I'm one. I'm paraphrasing, guys uh -huh. um, and gals. I don't know when the last Harvest Moon came out. I think it was a GBA port, though. But uh, a while. Girlfriend Reviews was doing like a, a collab with uh, Leia, or Leah? I think it's Leah, which is uh, Donkey's wife or girlfriend. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. I was like, I don't know who that is. And and uh, I've seen them in interviews together, and they're they're adorable together. Uh, Donkey and Leah. I watched Leia. in Leia? H3H3, I think it's which Leia. I don't really like H3H3. H3. He's, he's a fine individual. It's just, I don't usually like listening to stuff, but his interview with Donkey was good. I like listening to Dunk and his wife yeah. or girlfriend. I don't know 100% what their relationship is, yeah. but I know the his, sig his significant other. There you go. Go. That's um, the word. But but Le oh, Leah boy. is fucking adorable. And then along with uh, I don't know the girl's name from girlfriend reviews. I don't. Know um, I'm sorry. But oh, uh, she's fucking adorable too. So when you watch the video, you're like, ah, cuteness overload. Oh, I want a cuteness. <laughs> get out of here. Yeah, go watch girlfriend reviews, guys. It's like Mabel times 400. Get out of here. They're That's amazing. So <laughs> oh. Uh, I, I I I take time to go watch it with Jen. And just, just like have absolute like adorable time watching it. I'm like, oh my god, these people! Why are they so fucking cute? <laughs> it's not fair. That much cuteness should not be in one individual. Um, it's like what Sarah Silverman would be if she didn't always make dick jokes all the time. She doesn't all the time. She doesn't all but, the time. <laughs> I mean, she can't when she's playing. What? Uh, what's her little face? Uh, uh, the Vanel glitch girl. Vanilla Vanel Vanel Sweets. Yeah. Yeah, Vanilla Pimon Sweets. Yeah. Man, I did not think I was gonna like her in that role, and I, I said thought I was gonna hate her in that role because I'd I'd never liked her sketch comedy. But then I watched. I was like, okay, maybe there's more to Sarah Silverman than I gave her chance. And the more I've when I hear in interviews, mm -hmm. she's way more interesting half the time. I think you gotta go down there. There you yeah. go. Yeah, I was just seeing um, if there's any little extras. Yeah, what? the uh, I, I wasn't too fond of Sarah Silverman. I wasn't that exposed to her before. But That's true too. I'd only seen like an <clears throat> episode or two of her comedy show, and mm -hmm. just it, it, it didn't have that key and P level of quality. Yeah, I mean, like, does she was it a skit show? Yeah, I think it was like in the vein of like Mad. Okay, uh, so Mad like TV. SNL and yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. Ooh, stage play. This guy's going to be right in his Which element. Which is kind of huh? ironic, because I have to go to a talent show later tonight. <laughs> one of my kids is leaving the school. They're like, hey, you're subbing here today. You have is he one here. of your kids also one of your clients? Because they say, hey. Yeah, all my kids say, hey. <laughs> Everyone's the fawns in my world. What the fuck is this thing? Is that Dante? It said proto something. Pseudo. Scudo Angelo. Scudo Angelo. It kind of looks like a devil trigger form. Getting the band back together, huh? Okay, these but must yeah. be uh, like bad guys from before. I think so, yeah. Oh, One of my kids asked me destroy. right as I was about to leave. It's like, can you come to the talent show? And I was like, uh, yeah, I don't have a good excuse. And sure. I mean, other than the recording for the channel. Other than the recording for the channel. But I mean... I don't, I don't think it was necessary for them to put the wall behind you. Like, you weren't going to be able to uh, get hey. out. Oh. Oh, okay, never mind. <laughs> All right. Um, what the fuck? Yeah, no, th that wall is definitely necessary. <laughs> I was uh, like, I it's not... They could have just, They could have just pulled up the... Uh, like the little blood walls or whatever, so you couldn't leave. But now that I see, it's an entire Woo! stadium moving along. Oh, okay. I think uh, that was I think that was V that did that lightning move. Oh, was Remember it? the V pincher type things? I think. Now I'm not 100 percent sure. But it's really tight that you get to fight alongside him now instead of like yeah. actually on the side of him What's in the cool subway. What's cool too is they put him in the beginning of the menu now too. So like when it shows Nero mm -hmm. at the start, V's now on your right. It'd be kind of cool if you could, at this point, choose if you wanted to play Nero as the boss, <coughs> rather than, like, oh, I don't play Nero in the level, but V against the boss. 
You know, oh, so you, yeah. could, you had a little bit of additional more change up points. Well, I think once you unlock Dante too, you're gonna get to choose whoever you want to play as. Yeah, and, I mean a, a little nitpick, but it's cool that they allow you to choose already off the bat. That's this level is also not too long, yeah. so I think okay. that's part of it. Why that V lightning is definitely V. Okay, I, I, good, saw, good. I saw it came out of the uh, Hawkbird, Falcon, Raven. Oh. Uh, Get out of here, Dark Knight. Nobody wants you here. Go back you're, to Final Fantasy. You're dead, buddy. Well, you will be. I don't know where your health bar is exactly. Uh, you have a ton of arms, man. You really don't use them. No, I, I really like keeping the one jump. I don't like exploding them too often. Because mm -hmm. then I have to use ones I'm like, I don't want to use this one. I don't know what raw hide does. It uh, makes the hide real raw. Mm. It's uncooking them. Woo. Give me those style points. You're, uh, you're going to fall into a giant pit. Ah, oh, no, I'm going to jump off. <laughs> Just hop on the ledge. Yeah, I wonder if like long. you you don't do it fast enough, like you fail and just fall into the pit. <laughs> like, a, like a failed quick time event. <laughs> Wilhelm scream. <laughs> Once before. Is that so? Uh-huh. Mm. So I can see so you guys we pay he, attention to story. Was every he now a then? demon and then lost his memory or because a lot of people seem to be recognizing him. Here. He's obviously some kind of demonic entity. I well, don't know. I mean, he's summoning that was the house. What we would, what uh, Dante told us. Dante Tuan yeah. told us. It's like uh, old bosses or whatever, the Falcon and the Panther or something this like that. Is where we mm -hmm. ways. Oh, go ahead. but but I just got to play as you. Uh, maybe you'll get Dante soon. No. Maybe. I must seek out the huh. sword Sparta. Doesn't Dante have that? So maybe you go idea. back to playing Trust as V. Me. Maybe. And get Dante then. I think so. Is the audio sound kind of weird to you? Like uh, the voiceover? I've got a beanie on and my thing, but voiceover sounds fine to me. Huh. It's a little wispy. Not the only one. It just V's sound kind of weird, and I don't know if it was always <clears> like that or not. Telling me? Yeah, why are you being so enigmatic? Yeah, why are you not telling us things? Especially because, uh, I mean, like, uh, I'm coming in on the fifth game and don't really know any of it, so on top of that, it, it kind of doesn't... I've... Ooh, S rank. Um, I have played most of them, well, played a couple of them, and watched the history for all of them, and I don't know what he's talking about. All right, next mission. Let's do it. You got like 20, 30,000 fucking souls from that one, Yeah, I've got a decent amount to spend. I think it's going to throw me right into the menu after this. Cutscene! June 15th. Hey, that's not too long after Mike's birthday. No, it's not. Less than a week. Guess there's no point. Happy birthday, about. Mike. It's the apocalypse. <laughs> what did you do? You brought it about! How many days into the uh, demon apocalypse were we? Did, what day did it start? I can't remember. The 13th? Could he have stopped that if he wanted? He pr she probably would have hit him and he'd been fine. Perfect time. Probably. Now just a giant dent in the car. I mean, he got hit with a van previously and just kind of walked out of it. That's true. Get in the car. <laughs> For fucking once. <laughs> <laughs> it's, just, it's just so much this game. Yeah. I love it. I would hate it in anything else. But in this, it's like, oh, wow, they fucking nailed it. I'm also curious as to how she joined the devil, like, may cry outfit. Like, how did she get Wasn't hired? Wasn't her mother the gunsmith? Was it? Is that what it is? I mean, she mentioned her mother, and then oh, she showed she? the gun up on the wall. This was two weeks ago, like, yeah. so, I mean, it'll be... I mean, that makes sense, then, if that was her mom, because they mentioned yeah. her mom in one of the comments. Ooh, tomboy. It was, like, two weeks ago, so... <clears throat> Buster arm. Well, I mean, wasn't one of these uh, a Mega Man arm? We didn't see it, but I've right. seen it. I've seen uh, it. That's DLC, so oh, I didn't okay. pay for that. Okay, no big deal. Rack time. Holy shit, they got a ton. Yeah. You got to start using them so you can find some new favorites, man. Yeah, probably. I mean, you just got, what, three, four new arms? Do you have to buy them, though? You have to pay for them, usually. Oh, that ain't bad, though, because look how many souls you have. True. It's going to take, like, 20 grand to buy all those arms. Red Queen, any more combos? What do I got? Yeah, let's upgrade some stuff. Hayline... What's Especially that? if you're going to be playing as him for a while. Ooh, that's good. Definitely taking that. Mm -hmm. Uh, hard way. What's he doing? Ooh. Eh, that's cool, but that's 20,000. Caliber? Let's see. What does this one do? Ooh, that's pretty good. You, I mean, if since you got Payline, I think Caliber would probably couple with it well, because both of them are air-based attacks. Yeah, probably. Let's learn Exceed. Get to the third one. Max Act, holy shit. Wait, what was Max Act? That one was 45,000. You actually have enough right now. Do you... Uh, 
right after the attack, exceed with perfect timing. I'm gonna skip that one. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah it just seemed like one of those like OP ones probably because they were so expensive. Yeah, color up. Final upgrade to color up, cramming explosive power into Ooh. your bullets. Hold X to fill up the bullet gauge. I don't use color up that much. Do you? Yeah, I was gonna say, do you use the gun that much? Abilities, table hopper. What is this? Ooh. Ooh, this is very hyper light. Yeah, I'm gonna take that. It's an invasive maneuver though, so you're gonna have to remember how to use it when you're dodging right. stuff. And it then. kind of niche, but I don't know. A little yeah, niche, but that. I do like my dashy dash. Do uh, while you still have some money, do you want to buy those arms or no? Nah, I'm gonna go ahead and just get. Uh, I want a little bit more ground game. Okay. While on the ground, hold and release Y. In mid air, RB and Y back four. I think hard way is probably the better idea. Yeah. Cause, I mean, because uh, now you have a ground game one, and now you have pay line, which is the air game one, right. you know? So it, it seems like you're uh, getting a little bit more leveled out. Get that fifth one unlocked. Max size up, yo. Okay. Cool. Nice. Whitman. How about, because uh, you don't have too much more money to spend. No. Buy in bulk. You buy all of them for 10000 That's awesome. That's pretty good. I what mean, I'm assuming it's a deal. That's at the very bottom. I'm assuming it's a deal. Buy in bulk. Purchase one of each devil well, arm. Let's, let's add available. it up. That's 5,500 for Ragtime and Buster already. Yeah. 6,500 6, for the three of those. Tomboy. 7,500, 7, 8,500, 9,000. Huh. Maybe it's not better than... It's Does probably it better when you get later in the game when there's way more. Yeah, I was going to say, it looks like the difference was 1,000 souls, to, and it was extra. Eh, that's good enough. Yeah, that's good enough. We will see you guys as soon as we know. There we go. We will see you guys next time. Beep, bop, boop. Oh, go ahead. Go ahead say it. Oh, cool. They gave her clothes finally. <laughs> I think she's still wearing the robe. She dropped the robe. Went she like did. Full on. Yeah, uh, can I get some clothes? JJ Abrams. Yeah. Glare, and then I think they gave her clothes. But maybe not. She's wearing a mechanic jumpsuit. That's perfect. Who the fuck has a gives a white mechanic jumpsuit though?